It's the Off Your Face Music Festival. Five days, one killer act. The main stage is set for DJ Underage Crave. 120 hours straight, all ages. On stage two, there'll be sick beats playing non-stop on one iPod to share. That's not all though, there'll be silent reading. Sniffer dogs on bikes. Rehydration station slash toilet. There'll be ciggy butts on the ground. For sale. Private sex areas. Forecast heavy rain. Under-trained St John ambulance crew. Drug-inducing room. Suicide room. And prayer room. Have fun in there, guys. Silent disco. Girls in skimpy clothing. In magazines scattered around the grounds. And if you pill heads start to get peckish, we're serving a tic-tac on a plate to satisfy your hunger. Although that might be a bit much. Don't hold your breath, but we might have DJ Bunny Bun doing a main stage set. It probably won't go off though, because she doesn't like loud noises. It's not just a music festival though. There'll be timeshare information sessions on investments in cute animal clothing companies expanding in regional Australia, held every hour on the hour. It's the perfect thing to consider when you're off your fucking head. Tickets are available to purchase online via a notorious child pornography website. And if you get too rowdy, it's nap time for you. I I can't fucking sleep, man. I've had too much fucking MDMA. Go to bed or I'll knock you out. Oh, fuck all right. Fucking hell. Our security guards are cassowaries, so don't jump the fence. This is Gina. She's a pickaxe on legs, so you better run, boys. If you have a problem with drugs, mainly with the lack of strength of drugs these days, we'll sort you out with the strong stuff. These pills are the fucking bomb, mate. I had three, and I'm only 17 years old. Just get your wristband badly tattooed on at the gate, and you're good to go. It's the Off Your Face Music Festival. These paid actors we date raped won't be there. Will you?